In this video, I'm going to show you how to transfer Google Photos to laptop. So, as you can see, I'm inside Google Photos right now, and you should be too. And then, no matter how many images or photos you have in here, you'll be able to download or transfer them all at once, very simply. So, what you want to first do is go to the very top right where you can see your profile picture, and click on it, and then press over here where it says Manage your Google account. From here, you want to go to the left where it says Data and Privacy, and just click on that. And then you want to scroll down, so all the way down until you see this part where it says data from apps and services that you use. And under apps and services, you simply want to click content saved from Google services. So just click on this row over here, scroll down and then you will find photos eventually. There we go. So we've got photos over here. What you want to do is then press download and this will take you to the Google takeout photo page. Now, to take these photos out, what you then should do is simply check mark over here where it says your photos and videos from Google Photos and make sure this is selected and then what you want to do is press continue. Now, once you press continue, you, as you can see, you can select how you want the transfer to be done. So, you can either get a download link via email or you can add to Drive, Dropbox, OneDrive or Box. So, usually you just want to have the send download link via email, which usually works the best. So then you have to select the frequency. It says export once or export every two months for one year. So of course, if you want to export all the images right now, you just want to press export once. And then under file type and size, you want to leave this as zip because usually it's the easiest to extract. And then the file size should be, so it depends on however many images you've got. So let's say you don't have that many images, two gigabytes is going to be good enough. However, you can also put it 10 or 50 gigabytes in case you have a lot of images. And of course, if you have a lot of images, this will take quite a bit of time to complete. So let's say I'm going to leave this at two gigabytes, but you should put it at least 10 or 50. Then once you've done this, you want to press create export. And then as you can see, it will say export progress. And then this will start loading a bit. And after that's done loading, there we go. As you can see, you will then get this export progress. Google is creating a copy of data from Google Photos. So as you can see, it says this process can take a long time, possibly hours or days to complete. You'll receive an email when your export is done. Now, of course, this will take quite some time as it says over here. And once it's done, you will get an email. So just go to that email. And then from there, you'll be able to download and export your images from Google Photos. So that's pretty much it. I hope this video helped you out. And if it did, please subscribe to the channel and help me out as well.